Hello everyone, my name is Our Trooper and welcome back to another video. Today I'm showing you guys how to install Stop the Pet Extended to your LSPDFR. If you guys have never installed a Stop the Pet Extend mod, for instance questions and maybe some other things you can do, basically it's the sort of thing which kind of aims to provide a greater experience with you Stop the Pet and tries to up the immersion within your game, normally adding more questions and normally sometimes changing it to fit a country that you're role-playing in a little bit better. But basically, if you guys want a little bit more information, you can read all of this right here. I pretty much read what it said right here, but with a little bit more explanation. So read all of this here to see what it means. But basically, if you guys have never installed them before, it's pretty basic, and it's pretty much the same way of installing any other plugin. So to install this, all you guys want to do is go to download this file, or click the first download link down in the description below if you guys cannot get to this, and then click here. And then what you guys are going to want to do, you're going to want to open it on up, Find your GTA 5 main directory. So to get to that, all you guys want to do is go to your file explorer. And once you're inside of here, go to EverDrive and install the GTA 5 on. For those of you guys on Steam, I'm going to show you guys how to get to that right now. But for those of you guys on Epic Games and Rockstar Games, your GTA 5 main directory will be down in the description below. But for those of you guys on Steam, all you guys are going to want to do is go to Program Files 86. Go down to Steam. Then go to Steam Apps and Common. And then choose the GTA 5 main directory, but mine's not here because for some reason I chose to put it somewhere custom, even though it really wasn't worth it. And then all you guys want to do is grab your download, double click in the stop the pet extended file, and right here you should be able to see that there is a st traffic stop questions XML and a custom questions XML. Now if we go into the X, if you went into the TXT installation file, you guys can see right here. It's pretty much the same way as installing any other add-ons or any other plugins to your LSPFR, but with a couple of extra steps. So all you guys want to do is go into your plugins, and then go into LSPDFR, and then go into the Stop the Ped folder, and then all you guys are going to want to do is grab the download, see this custom questions XML here, drag and drop that into your thing, into your folder even, and then all you guys want to do is hit replace the file in the destination. And then for this one, all you guys are going to want to do is drag and drop it in again and do the exact same thing, replace the files in the destination. And just like that, you guys have now successfully installed a top the ped extender to your LSPDFR. Hope you guys did find this video useful. If you did, please be sure to like, comment and subscribe. And then also make sure you check out all my other videos on how to install LSPDFR mods. And I know a lot of common issues that you guys have been having recently is normally that your mods folder is empty. So if your mods folder is empty, all you guys have got to do is watch my video on how to properly install a mods folder because that will clear a couple of things up with why your mods folder is empty. But other than that, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see all you guys in the next video. Cheers and goodbye.